Hi, Chris Wallace from Second Swing. I'm with Chuck Theory from Zexio. Chuck, it was a year ago, almost exactly, we were standing in the same spot. You guys had just announced Ernie Els yeah, as yeah. a spokesperson. It's been an exciting year for you growing the brand in North America. For those who still aren't maybe familiar with Zexio, tell us a little about the company's philosophy and what you're trying to do for golfers out there. Yeah, perfect, perfect question, Chris. Um, like you said, there's a lot more people familiar with us today than there were a year ago, so the brand is growing pretty quickly. What makes us different than other brands, I guess, is our focus. We are 100% focused on moderate swing speed men and women. Uh, so probably much different than most brands who really start their thinking with a tour philosophy. Not the case here. As you mentioned, we have Ernie, but Ernie is really a global ambassador. We think he's really good for the brand and he's helped raise that brand awareness. But for the most part, we're focused just on this moderate swing speed player. Sure, and with Ernie, you know, of course, known for years as the Big Easy, one of the great things about these clubs is you're trying to make it easier for players to generate a little bit more distance. Yeah, you nailed it again. Any of our marketing stuff, anything you look at about Zexio, we use the word easy all the time. That's why he was a natural fit for us. They really are easier to swing, easier to hit high, easier to hit straight, easier to hit long. Uh, we would encourage all your listeners and viewers to try them, and I think they'll see it in one swing. Yeah, and brand new for you guys in 2019 is the new Zexio Prime line. Drivers, fairways, hybrids, irons. Tell us a little bit about what's going on from a technology standpoint to fuel performance with this lineup. Zexio Prime is what we like to call the Zexio of Zexio. Um, our, our brand in general is lighter and softer. So Zexio 10 is light and soft, but Zexio Prime is really light and really soft. So it's kind of for the ultimate person that struggles with club head speed. There's a lot of people in my generation that are losing speed every year and when you watch them at the range, what you see is ball flight that goes like this. With Zexio Prime, because of the way we build it, they'll immediately see ball flight that goes like this. Um, a couple things about the club, Chris, like the driver you're holding, that grip is only 22 grams, which is about a third the weight of most other grips in this building. The shaft is only 35 grams, extremely lightweight for a driver. The head is actually slightly heavier by comparison. And all of that combined with a higher balance point actually reroutes the golf club, puts it on a more economical swing path, if you will, delivers it to the ball faster, and brings you more center hits. It's a little kind of, you gotta think about it for a second, but basically the kind of the Zexio secret sauce is light, light, slightly heavier, and then a balance point way up towards the grip. And there's not anybody else in here that makes a golf club quite like that. And the irons, I noticed, especially have a wider sole, probably getting that center of gravity down low again to sort of help that player with that launch. Yeah, you nailed it again. When I look at that iron, I immediately think super game improvement and ball go high. The sole is like that wide. It's like hitting off of a lie board. You know, it kind of self-corrects, hits that ball up into the air. But the philosophy behind the golf club is the same as the woods. Again, lighter grip, lighter shaft, slightly heavier head the balance point that's moved way up towards the, the grip. And I think every player of yours that tries it will immediately see that ball jump up into the air and go further. And I think it's important to point out that what I would maybe say about Zexio is, while these clubs will help you improve your game, to call them game improvement clubs may be a little bit misleading because these are premium materials that you're using and these clubs aren't just like lightweight components, they're engineered for everything to work perfectly together. Yeah, I mean, you know the line well. You, you're kind of reminding me of some of our own <laughs> technology. Yeah, we're the only probably company in this entire building that makes their own shafts. And the one thing that's very different about Zexio from other companies is that this grip is actually weighted to go with this shaft, which is weighted to go with this head. So much so that this three wood grip is different than that driver grip, which is different than this hybrid grip. Okay, we take a lot of care. As you mentioned, premium components. It's the highest grade titanium in golf. These are Miyazaki shafts made in Japan specifically for these golf clubs. So yeah, they're really unique. And um, with this player, with our target player, who is somebody who needs help with speed, we kind of go the extra distance to make sure that we're doing everything we can for them. Yeah, so if you're a second swing customer, 
and you fall into the category that Chuck's describing, you're getting a little older maybe, losing a little club head speed, the game's getting a little more difficult, you're really going to want to take a look at Zexio Prime, maybe add a few yards, pick up a few miles an hour at club head speed, get back out there on the golf course and have a little bit more fun. Chuck, we appreciate the time today. Awesome. Thank you, Thanks. Chris. I appreciate it. Thanks.